Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today we're going to Disneyland uh, Anaheim. Uh, it's gonna be me, my daughter, and my husband when he gets off of work, so we're going there. I just wanted to show you what I bring. I know I made a video earlier this year, not too long ago, maybe like about a month ago, in regards to what I bring to the park. Um, I have cut down, added a little bit more, and just revamped my whole how I pack for the park and that's her in the back um, so I got this Le Sport sack um, it's a small world bag a long time ago I don't even remember what it's called I got it when she was born it was available on Zulily for sale so I purchased that and also one other one so we're gonna go with, through the front pocket first and then I'm gonna do the top pocket or the main pocket so in the front pocket I have hand sanitizer and that's a must, uh, especially if we can't get to the bathrooms right away and we touch the railings or touch something that we can't really like readily wash our hands with, hand sanitizer is the best. And then I also have this foldable water bottle. My son actually got this for walking to school and getting there early, so he's letting me use it for the day. And then of course, Advil, um, that's a must, I get headaches. Um, body starts hurting towards the end of the day so I have Advil, have my chapstick, I have um, lip liner, it's like a deep purple, it's uh, by Prestige, I don't even know what color it is, it's called wine but it's a very very deep purple, I don't know if you can see that, and then I also have the NYX liquid suede in number 12, it's called Vintage, it matches that purple very well. And then I also have a very small container of, there's Benadryl and uh, Tylenol in there as well. I have an extra set of contacts for me. Um, usually when I go to the park, I don't wear my glasses. I have my sunglasses on, but they're not prescription, so I use my contacts with them. Uh, and then I also have another form of hand sanitizer. Now this is by The Honest Company, and it's a spray form instead of the gel form. So I have that just in case we run out of this one because this one is getting pretty low. And then, so for the main pocket, I have my wallet and my my wallet pretty much and it's attached to the Tsum Tsum lanyard. You can get this at any of the parks. So I have my uh, Jujube B charge in the uh, Donatella Sweet Shop print. And here is my ID, my annual pass, I have a gift card that I got for my birthday and then um, of course Disney debit um, so that's all in there and then in the central pocket there's really nothing in there sometimes I'll keep some cash in there um, but for the most part all the cash is in here and this is a Jujube uh, Hello Kitty TikTok coin purse so I have cash in here and then extra cards as well Then, um, so when we go to the park, my husband usually hands me his wallet and I always end up carrying it. So that'll be in here too. But since he's not here and he has it, then it's not in here. Uh, I also carry, like I said, my sunglasses. When we go to the park, I'll be wearing these. These are my favorite ones. Um, uh, like I said, I always wear contacts when I go to the park. I don't want to wear my glasses because it's sunny. So I don't have prescription sunglasses yet. Um, and then in this, this is my travel station, portable travel station. So um, it's my travel chargers, I should say. So I have one portable charger and it's a my charge and it gives your phone up to one full charge. I have the plug I, and I also have one more travel charger. Now this one can give my phone up to two full charges. And with this, it came with a uh, USB cable, but because I have the iPhone 7 Plus, um, the cable that it comes with is a micro USB. I don't know if you can see that. So with that, I had to purchase the lightning adapter, and that's this little thing right here. don't know if you can see that. So all this does is it plugs into the micro USB, like so. And then I'm able to charge my um, my iPhone. So I don't really like bringing the OEM cord that my phone came with, just because I don't want to ruin it. It's the only one that I have. I just got my phone not too long ago, so I have two of these. I have one 
one in the car I think and then this one stays in my like I said stays in my little travel station so that goes in here along with two portable chargers and this one just in case now for this one the my charge to charge it all you do is you take this part off and plug it into the wall 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 charger and then I'll use that same sync cable to charge my phone and then for the baby I have extra clothes um, she is very she's very well potty trained she knows how to use the restroom but just in case we get wet or she does have an accident I do have extra clothes for her here uh, also I would also like to mention that I just started the pin quest um, what, a week ago when we went last actually we went for my birthday so I, I was at store command the Toy Story with the little green alien store by Buzz um, Astro Blasters. I was in that store and I purchased the Pin Quest um, pin set there. So my first pin I actually got was from there. I don't know if you can see that. And there are six other pins. Um, so when we go back to the park today, I'm going to try to attempt to um, get a couple more if I can and then go from there. So I'll probably give you an updated video on how I do that. So the pin quest comes with a pouch with a map and then also a decoder pin. So this pin um, helps you find the location of the next um, store that you're going to need to go to to obtain another pin. So what you do is this corner up here and this point up here, you will line them together. And then I don't know if you can see that, but in this window, it gives you the number. I mean, I'm sorry, the letter and the number that you would coordinate on your map. So that's how you find those. I'll probably do another video specifically on the pin quest um, later on. So that's pretty much all I pack um, with me when we go to the parks. Now, if you live in Florida, you and you go and you frequent Walt Disney World a lot, then I highly suggest you bring along your magic band. Um, this is your pass, your debit card, your everything to enter the park. So I definitely would advise you to obviously bring that. I know multiple of you have several of these. This is my only one. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much all I have packed for for us today. Not much. We're not going all day anyway, so that's what I have. Now, typically, if it's me and my husband that go, then I bring along this bag. And this is my Dooney and Burke um, sketch uh, crossbody bag. Now, this one, I love it, and it also matches my magic band, as you can see. It has a matching print, the matching making. So this matches my magic band. And when we do pack this, or when I do bring this, all I would bring is my, my tra little travel station. Of course, my wallet. It doesn't, uh, sometimes I, I switch this up and sometimes I just bring this and hang it off my lanyard and this goes in the bag. Um, and then, what else would I bring? Of course, I would bring my Advil, my hand sanitizer, and then my chapstick, of course. Depending if I'm in the mood or not, sometimes I'll bring these, sometimes I won't. Of course, I always have to bring extra contacts no matter where I go. And then, of course, the Benadryl. Now, the thing is, since I'm going to be having a backpack today, I'm debating whether or not to bring this. Because the thing with the backpack is I don't like having to take it off, to look in it and keep on doing that throughout the day if I need something. So for example, if I need to put my phone away, I think I'm just gonna bring this little uh, Victoria's Secret fanny pack thing just for quick access items like my wallet and stuff like that. So I'll probably put, like I said, put my phone in here, put my wallet, what else did I put in here? Uh, of course, chapstick. So I probably just put all that stuff in here while I'm walking around the park with everything else in my in the main bag. Um, if you have any questions, uh, suggestions, comments, go ahead and leave them in the comment box below. I will definitely get back to you if you do leave me a comment. Uh, I just want to thank you all for watching, and if you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe. Thanks.